Hello, day 23, and this weight still stays where it was. Again, I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried if it stays where it is now. I'm right till the end. I'm happy with it. Like I said, I've, it's one stone, four pounds I've lost so far in weight. So that's that's pretty good. Within a little 30 odd day, nearly 30 days. I think that's quite good so far. Uh, obviously my waistline's come in as well, so I've lost a lot of weight around my waist. So yeah, all good. I'm just gonna take this dog for a walk, get these steps in this morning. I've got to then take my little boy to school. I then got clients to do. <laughs> I think I'll go back to the hospital. So yeah, it's quite hard to try and get. I am getting all my food in, just. It's not too bad, I'm getting it all in. And then whatever I'm not hitting, I'm just basically hitting it when I get home. And I normally just crash and go straight to sleep after that. So yeah, I'm just running around like a headless chicken at the minute. It's all good though. Okay, so I'm gonna take this dog for a walk. Do that, take the boys to school, and I'll try and get some footage in. It's getting hard what to film now, because obviously where I'm doing these every single day, I don't want to be showing you the same old things every single day. I'm just showing you how I'm coping on it as well. My energy levels are still fine though, so I can't really complain about all that. Okay, so I'll catch you guys when I get, I'll try and get some more footage on and get to see when we get back. Go, getting some more steps in. Got the bulletproof coffee going. Uh, where are we going, Mace? Like going to the road, that's it. Right, I'm just gonna take this one to school and then I'm gonna go and run a class online. See you in a bit. Okay, 10 o'clock class done. That was day 19, I believe. Yeah, day 19 for them. Um, just had to run to Asda to go get some more food. So I've had to do like a, I've done a big shop for about well, I've done about seven days, but mostly that's for the kids. So I've done three days of all my stuff as well. And then obviously when that's run out, I'd go and replace it with some more stuff. Ah, oh, I'm telling you. And then I've just got to go and pop up, see my friend. I've then got to take the little ones over to karate. A oh, busy, busy day today. Um, energy levels are still high. High as anything. It's really odd as well. So, yeah, I'm, I'm nearly at the end of this as well. Um... Everyone keeps asking me what I'm going to do after this and that. I'm just going to get, basically all I'm going to do is I'm probably going to have a cheat meal and then just get back on my normal diet, which I normally get back on to. Okay, where I do have the carbohydrates, I have the French toast, it's lovely it is. I have all the wraps and everything. Right, so I'm going to catch you in a bit because my train's now going and I can actually move off this flipping train track. So I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so just received my protein order, ready for when I come off of this 30 day challenge. So I've got my BCAAs ready to go. So obviously that's gonna fl just flavor up my water as well, just makes my water a little bit more interesting. Um, I've got some pre-workouts as well. What flavor is this? This is a tropical flavor, so it's a handy pouch that you just take out. And it's just like a pre-workout, 10 minutes pre-workout. And then I've got my carb crushers as well, which is 23 grams of protein per bar. What flavor did I get for these? Fudge brownies. Yeah, looking forward to them. So I've just got to wait for my muscle food holder to come now and my skinny food company. They are delivering me a load of low fat sources as well. Okay, so that's all ready to go. I've got my protein powder, I've still got tons of it left, so I didn't really need to worry about that. Okay, so that's that done. I'm now just gonna go off and train a client. I've just had some bacon and some eggs and avocados and all that lot, so I'm fine. But that's ready for when I come off. So that'll be sitting, ready to go. Okay, done some more clients. Now gonna go and pick my little boy up, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Say hello. Hello. Look how tall she's got. How tall are you now? 1.3. 1. 1.3. 1. 1. Say bye. Bye. Say, where are we going? Pick up me, Alright, see you in a bit. Hmm? Mason! Way! Right, I've done my last client for the day and now we're going. Where are we going, Mace? Pick You're going to do your class. Chloe, where are you going? You're doing your class. You're going for your black belt, aren't you, in September? Yeah, so she's going for a black belt in December. 
Yes, we know what belt you are. You're right at the bottom, but it's fine. You can work your way up. Okay? You'd be a black lot like your dad one day, wouldn't you, mate? I want to be a sensei. You want to be a sensei, knuckle dusters, dude. Right, I'll see you in a bit. Show off. Do you ever stop eating? Uh -uh. Nah, I didn't think you did. There you go, you've just done karate in the field, haven't you, with everyone else? Uh -huh. Yeah, look at the state of you. Just all red in the face. <laughs> What are you like? You're not too bad. You did your class, then you just sat in the, in the shade, didn't you? Yeah? Right, say bye-bye. See you in a bit. Bye-bye. See you in a bit. Okay, well, I got home with the kids. I had a quickly cook dinner. I started cooking dinner. I'm now going to go and pick my brother up. It's broken down his van. So, guess what? I'm eating. I'm driving at the same time. So, I'm literally picking at this while I'm eating. It's literally pork chops, Brussels sprouts, all sautéed in Kerrygold butter. But yeah, I'm gonna go and eat this, and then I've got to travel all the way down to Hayward Teeth to go and pick him up, because the bugger's broken down, and guess who's gonna to have to tow him? Me! I'll see you guys when I get home. Yeah, man. Okay, so I'm gonna finish this vlog off here. I've had some dark chocolate. Just finishing off my keto hot chocolate now, which is quite nice, actually. Really, really nice. Um, as you can see, my weight has stayed where it is. I'm not worried about it because I know it's coming off in other places. It's coming off around my arms. It's coming off everywhere. You're just not going to see it. Um, so, yeah, that's what I mean. When you're dieting and you're weighing yourself every day and, yeah, you can see results at the beginning. Then all of a sudden it just dips. It might go up a little bit. Then it goes down. It goes up, down, down. It's fine. Don't worry about it too much. This is why I get people not to weigh themselves every day. I'm doing it every day just to show you what's happening. Normally, I would rather people did it every seven to ten days, put the weight on, like weigh themselves and take measurements as well. Because it really does play with the top of your head. Okay, when you sit, especially if you're doing it every single day, you will see it's dipping and stuff. I mean, it doesn't play with my head because I know what's happening. So... That's what I mean, it really does play with people's mental health and really gets them going. They're like, oh, like that, start panicking. Then they're like, oh, I can't do this anymore, I give up. And then that's it. They stop doing everything that they're doing because they're, seeing, they're not seeing what they want to see. Um, so this is why I'm doing it, to show you what it's doing. So just remember, and if people are commenting in the street saying that you look really good, trust me, they are telling you the truth. They've not seen you for a week, two weeks, three weeks, maybe four weeks, maybe longer. Someone says to you, you look really, really amazing. Take that as a compliment, okay? They're obviously seeing something that you're not, okay? So just think to yourself, someone says that. Someone says that to me now. They say it to me all the time, and I'm like, it just gives me more motivation to keep going, okay? So don't give up. Okay, everything is up here, okay? If you think you want to give up, think about why you started this in the first place, okay? Do you want to, can you see and have a look? Take a journal of it, write it down, and have a look, see how far you've come down that ladder, okay? Do you really want to stop now? Because you've come this far, okay? And weight loss takes forever, it takes a long time to put it on. It takes even longer to get it off, okay? But once it's gone, it's gone. You'll be fine, okay? So I'm going to catch you guys tomorrow, okay? Um, so, yeah, I'll see you guys in the morning.